So, jack the airbags up using 25 psi. Got the stands under much higher than they've had before. Let the airbags down, and the wheels are now not touching. Not touching the ground, which is what I wanted. I wanted them primarily to make it easier to put the stands under but also take the weight off the tyres which is the stands are there to stop the rocking of the fifth wheel and also to uh, reduce the weight on the tyres because everybody hears about blowouts and I'm convinced that the blowouts occur because the tyres are left on the ground for extended periods of, ground, of time in storage or not being used and when you set off Semmers caravans you set off the ply rate, plies have been, inside the tyres have been distorted and they flex and separate the tread, distort the rubber and eventually get hot and blow out. So hence the reason uh, for raising the weight off, off the tyres. I did use the stands before, it's a hassle jacking it up to get the stands under. This was a lot, lot easier. And I've raised it probably a good three inches to what I've normally had. You can see on the far side, you can see daylight under the tyres. So far, so good. That's why I bought two. And the suppliers did ring me up and say, are you sure you know what you're doing? Do you want two lots of airbags? Because if they're not supported and they jack up at the same time, they can actually fall off the airbags. But no, I jacked up one side at once. You can see the front stand, front legs come up off the blocks. You can see the rear. We've just come back from touring, that's why there's so much mess around it. It's still sorting itself out. Came back last night. So, stand under both axles. I wanted the stands as far to the extremes of the axis I could so where it's the strongest they were about three inches in before and I was a bit concerned they'd bend I don't think they would because they're shared equally amongst four jacks four stands works very well very pleased watch this space so the bags are left there now I could pull them out if I wanted but I don't want to risk the, the, the stands sinking and then not being able to get them back under again Spare time for the ranger, storage pods, storage sheds, and that's the other side there, look. The scissor box in the middle there are doing nothing now really, because they, they originally bought to stop the sideways movement to the rig. They help a little bit, but not massively so. I'm going to leave them there just to... Uh, but then when I lower it down, unfortunately now I have to modify the steps, look. Because there are a big gap between. So I either need to get some blocks of wood, some more blocks of wood there, or some more blocks of wood there. Just bolted down with two balls at the moment.